Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Audrey Russo joins us live now from the Capitol. So Audrey, what is the timeline for this next extension? Nicole, the governor's current emergency powers are set to expire on February 15th. Now, as you said, they have been expanded several times throughout the pandemic, but the last time it was by a pretty slim margin. Now, Senate Republicans say they don't want to see this power extended again, and once again, they're ready to put up a fight. Governor Ned Lamont's emergency authority over the state was put into place in March of 2020 when the coronavirus threw the world into chaos. Six times the governor's powers were extended. Now, with that authority set to expire the day after Valentine's Day, Governor Lamont is working with the Senate president on a set of 10 to 12 executive orders that would extend the powers a seventh time. State lawmakers will consider those orders when they convene next month. The governor assuring people the emergency powers will be used for protecting public health and not abused. I think there's a narrow group of, of things going forward where it would be helpful for us to have a little agility to be able to move fast. But the Senate Republican leader is firing back, saying in part, quote, it's outrageous. There is no reason why the legislature cannot act as an equal branch of government to manage the pandemic response and represent the voices of our constituents. Now, as I mentioned, the last time the governor's pandemic powers were expanded, it was by a slim vote in the Senate. This happened back in the fall. There were 18 yes votes, 15 no votes, and three senators who chose not to vote at all. Live from the Capitol, Audrey Russo for Channel 3 Eyewitness News.